All right, so for some reason my recording stopped. That was weird, but it's fine. I it only you only missed like six months, and honestly, I just kind of sat around and messed with like the estates and stuff. I allied the platinate, and I started a humiliate war. Let's just move that to the side. I started a humiliate war with my rival Magdeburg. He's allied with Lubeck. I totally stack wiped Magdeburg because my heir, who I made a temporary general, is a two five. <laughs> so he was a really powerful general. So yeah, this is you really didn't miss too much. I feel really bad. It seems like my recording is always messing up, which really sucks. Yeah, currently, currently we have myself. We're, we almost have enough for spot <laughs> the emperor spot. We really need to get Saxony on our on our side. So let's improve relations with him. If we could get him up to a max of two hundred, we'll be set. We also have the Palatinate, who we can start pumping up relations with, and then we will for sure have the Emperor spot, and that'll be great. One thing I am going to do is I'm going to quickly bump up stability. It's cheap right now because we have the clergy loyal, so I mean, may as well. Just just so that we can't have any potential pop-ups or disaster risks. Anyways, let's look at this. Okay, so yearly prestige, we lose five ducats, not a big deal, and admin power, which a little bit of a bigger deal, but I think yearly prestige would be excellent. This war should be pretty quick. In fact, I'll, I'll bump it up to speed three. Mecklenburg have insulted us, how rude. We can almost get a claim on Neumark, which would be great. Oh man, I should get rid of one of these knights. They are so expensive and they're ugh, not good. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you there. We're gonna go take care of these chumps. Get there on the 9th, he'll be getting there on the 10th. He's already locked, holy cow. Oh no, we're getting there on the 11th. Okay, but that's fine. Um, we're gonna get a terrain crossing penalty. Oh man, a zero again? This is the second zero he's rolled, but that's fine. Um, we have really good shock pips, so I guess now I can go stack wipe him. I'm coming for you, <laughs> you shouldn't have requested military access. Uh oh, here comes a stack wipe. He's with you now? I don't really want to fight you to be honest. I have no diplomats, okay. I'm gonna bring back Saxony real quick. Oh wait, monthly tick, perfect, okay. Can I get Lubeck out? Really? You still want to go, pal? <laughs> okay. Let's shift consolidate. We'll leave this one troop on here just so that they can't mark up, and then we'll bring the rest back. So that we can get the ticking war score for this and get more. Also, because I don't want him to be in charge anymore, I just want this random general. So that's great. Yeah, this war is a really big... It's The reason I declare it as a humiliate war is because we don't want to take any land yet, because we don't want to is off everyone and so we're just we're just doing humiliate so we can get the cash and we actually have good cash inflow right now um we can get the power projection oh, there goes magdeburg that was really quick hey mecklenburg can i have access <laughs> i don't know why it i don't know why it like canceled on me thank you so now let's and this is just a good war because it's two opms they both have a ton of money mission fulfilled this trustworthy allies no it's just reminding me of imperial ambition again i'm not Super interested in this right now. I have one papal point. <laughs> nice. Oh, he's voting for Austria as well. Ah, curse you, Austria. Oh, the Palatinate is voting for himself, but maybe I could sway him. Once I'm done with this war, I will focus on, on getting that, because how old is the Emperor? He is 30, so it's not likely that he's going to be dying anytime soon. Too many Diplo relations, true. I can actually cancel this now, because since I'm not taking any land, I'll be black flagged and I can just walk back. I don't have enough? Holy cow, I need nine troops? Oh, maybe I shouldn't have canceled that because now I'm going to have to re-up it again. But that's fine. I'm going to... Unless I could just... I don't want to white piece him, but... Get a couple more troops. There are ten, so I'll be down... <laughs> We're going to be cutting it really close to a loan, but that's okay. Two ducats. I like it. How looted is this province? We're... Oh man, I wish I hadn't canceled that so quickly. I didn't realize that siege wasn't progressing, but that's fine. We're, we're looting this place, so it's great. It has a lot of loot. Look at that, 13 ducats of loot. Uh, Anhal has declared on Magdeburg conquest. Okay, good luck with that. Okay, so we could, get, we could gain 60 ducats, or we could gain trade efficiency and 50 diplo. Now it's tough, because we have two ducats right now, uh, but we're also about to get a ton. And trade efficiency, I feel like isn't going to be great, because we make so little of our money from trade. Like, we make a third as much as taxation. But I mean, 15% for 10 years is really powerful. I could do the math for that, but plus a 50 Diplo, I think I think that a long-term investment would just be better since we're still looting a ton and it, we're about to gain a ton of money as well. Since we are pretty much focusing on just looting right now, this is 
Not bad. And Mechlin. Oh, there are troops. Perfect. Let me back through your country. <laughs> Um, I, I kind of want to kill one of the cow. Uh, there's a really good video. I won't link it. Easy to find. Uh, but it's by Roomba. It's why cavalry suck and how to fix them. It's really good. Really good video. Highly recommend it. He's one of my favorite YouTubers. He's very good at this game. I've learned a lot of tricks from him. That's a good video. So plugging that because that explains why cavalry suck. And it makes a lot of really valid points that I support. Our armies are taking a lot of attrition. Now we have 10. Yeah, unfortunately we're not... We're gaining enough. We're just gonna leave the full army here. It's fine. Yeah, Lubeck is a uh, nice province. Look at this, 17 dev. That's that's high. Bohemia is claiming Berlin. Okay, I'm allied to Poland. Not sure if you've noticed, but that's fine. Yeah, Lubeck is really nice. Berlin, not bad. Uh, Prague, Prague is awesome. So we're gonna want to take Prague. Lubeck, you wanna you wanna be pieced out yet? Let's see. What is our attrition right now? Our attrition is one percent. One percent of 9.7. We gain 119 each month. We were enforced by 55. You want to leave? You, you had enough? Nope. Okay, you're gonna wait till I occupy. That's fine. Now, just while that's ticking, let's see how much money I could actually get from Magdeburg. 25 ducats? Not bad. Plus humiliate. Um, once I knock the other guy out, that's gonna be 100%. I think I probably prefer, prefer war reps. Ooh, Granada. They're gonna have a fun time. <laughs> fun time. Okay, so that's 823. Let's let's see how that. Oh, I'm not using one of my diplomats. I always forget that. I'm so sorry. Who are we close with on here? Saxony. Saxony is really close. If we could break Saxony, uh, that'd be awesome. Revelations. We're going to get a yearly tick. That's going to be great. Support me. <laughs> Don't support Austria. Austria is about to break because the Platinum takes two. We're about to have Saxony. And then we'll have two plus. Okay, we have two... According to that mission, we have two again, so Saxony is now voting for us. Awesome. Make a claim here. Oh, okay, that's cool. So it tells you how much dev it costs to get a core in a province. Fabricate a claim. Awesome. I don't have this this one, the like the ages one, and I can't remember which which DLC that is. We could declare against the Teutonic Order, but I would have to bring in I'd have to bring in Poland, and Poland would just take all this stuff. So and what I want to do is I would like to keep Poland out of it for as long as I could attack Neumark, take Neumark, and then Poland and I will both have a peace with the Teutonic Order. And I just won't give him any land. He won't be upset about it because I won't promise him land. I'll take that, and then he'll have a truce, so he won't be able to take any of the other stuff. And then I'll be able to take Pomerania and then move into Danzig before before Poland can take all that. I'm just trying to screw over my ally Poland before he gets too powerful because he's going to become the Commonwealth probably, almost certainly. And then he's going to be super powerful, and I'm not looking forward to that. Okay, so we're about to take this. There it goes. Okay, call back from Saxony. So let's call, call back from, from there. Four, three, two, one. Two for peace. Oh, now you now you want to. Okay, call your cash. Awesome. We have a 100% peace deal, so I can do whatever. War reps, transfer. Oh my gosh, I'm going to take Lubeck's trade power. That's going to be a lot. <laughs> uh, and old treaties. This would be good for prestige, I think. The ending rivalry will give me a lot of prestige. But I don't think I want anything else in here. Look at that. That that was a good piece deal. Totally worth the manpower used to do that. I was going down in manpower. We're about to get a lot of money from that, hopefully. Also cancel this in one day. And now let's send the other piece deal. You can see this is a lot less aggressive than the last time I played Germany. That's because last time I had a massive coalition and it was bad. <laughs> let's go to, can I null any treaties? would be more than 100% war score. Uh, that's a 90 piece. Oh, that's not too bad. I wish you had more money. What if I take off Humiliate? Like, what is the Humiliate getting me? I gained 30 power projection? Holy cow. War reps will be good. I think I think this will be fine. We'll just enforce military access. No, because I almost did. But if we do that, then we're being pushed over the below limit, and I would rather not do that. We'll just do a 75. That's, that's good. Look at all our money. <laughs> uh, do we want to just attack the Teutonic Order now? Does... What's Poland have claims on? Poland has claims on Gola and Kielmo. If I attack Neumark, I mean, I would be fine giving him one province. That would be that'd be fine. Um, he won't even join. Ooh, but Hungary. Well, they have a truce of the Teutonic Order. Hmm. And Saxons in another war. Well, I could bring in Cologne and the Platinate. How big is Hungary? Probably massive. <laughs> yeah, they have 19k. Okay, so maybe not. <laughs> 
But who are they? Are they allied with anyone else? The Livonian Order? I can't reach the Livonian Order. It could attack Alanhalt. Oh, they're allied with Saxony. They probably wouldn't like that. Yeah, Saxony would defend them. Uh, that was a good war, but I think we're kind of out of options now until we can take Neumark. Flatney is being self-centered. Who would do that? <laughs> Mines, no. Bohemia, no. If I could just get the Platinate to support me, or no, let's get Cologne, they're my ally. Why are you supporting Galeray? What? What? They look at it, we're making money. Oh wait, nope, that's just because of the spoils of war. But let's take a look at our trade now. So we have 5%. Holy cow, that one province is 5% of the Lubeck, and I don't even think that gives me all of his trade power. I think it's like 50%, I think, or maybe it is all. Yes, so I'm, re I'm receiving 23.3 from Lubeck. And Lubeck has 23.4. Okay, so I really do get all of his trade power. Okay, 100%. That's cool. Brunswick, I guess. I could maybe... I mean, Brunswick's pretty large. Um, maybe I will take that mission. I could use another diplomat. Yeah, let's do it. We also get 10 prestige from that. Okay. Uh, we're almost actually up to the power projection, so... I'm going to send an insult to Magdeburg. Will that bump me up over 47? Is he not my rival anymore? What's the deal? Insulted him. <laughs> What's the deal? Oh well, I guess I guess that didn't work, but that's fine. Let's insult Bohemia. <laughs> then an insult. Oh, now it says I will give him five power projection. Okay, nice. Now we're over fifty-two, so that gives us a ton of nice benefits. We have one extra leader with the, without upkeep, one of each of the points. That war was really. Really good. <laughs> Our guys really aren't that great, to be honest. Like, it's surprising that we're making this m many points. <laughs> okay, we have an expiry and cast this Bella against Mecklenburg. Oh, he, oh yeah, because he insulted us. How dare he? <laughs> so he's allied with, ooh, Pomerania. Um, and I don't have any claims on Pomerania, and I don't actually think I can... Oh, it tells me here, doesn't it? Okay. Monetary reparations and a concession of defeat. That's... Really not that good. That's a pretty weak Casus Belli. I could uh, ally him. <laughs> it's nice having Poland, but when does your truce actually break? Um, 1450s. Oh man. I could attack before 1450, but I wouldn't be with him. Saxony would get out of his war. I wish Hungary would just get out of here. Maybe with Saxony it would be okay, but Hungary is pretty beefy. Like 18k versus me. It would be 32k versus versus 11 what's so oh yeah no they they would highly outnumber us i do have a good general my my heir is a really good general i mean he's not perfect but he's a two star that's pretty good um one thing i can do is i can actually revolt i can revoke the uh one of the provinces from because i don't like that he's at 79 percent that it's really close. <laughs> okay, decrease our loyalty by 30 to 20%. Ugh. Influence by 18.3%. Okay, so I think I can do this because if you revoke, if you revoke while they're while they're disloyal, then they have rebel spawn. But if you push them into disloyalty, they don't have rebel spawn. Grouping gets loyal power vacuum until the 19th of, of 15 years, giving plus five local unrest. Now that's fine. What is it? So what is their their unrest is at zero. Poland has declared war on Crimea. All right. See, Poland's kind of nice because he can expand southward. They'll put him against the, the Ottomans, but he, I mean, also Lithuania. Oh, there's Muscovy taking over Novgorod. Rip in peace. <laughs> One of the big problems with Brandenburg is that the beginning can be a little slow. I could declare another humiliate war just to keep my power projection really high. Let's see. He's allied with this Martian. Now, this is a good one to call in Cologne and Palatinate in. Dith Martian. I think that's one of these guys up here. I don't recall. Taking out Brunswick and calling in Cologne the Palatinate, that'll make them really happy to be friends with me, and so I think that'll be a grand idea. It would be nice to use them against um, the Teutonic Order, but honestly, Poland will be able to take care of Hungary when that time comes, and so I don't mind calling in these two guys right now. Especially to get some more money and some more power projection. I think that will be fantastic. Let's get our really good guy and let's send him marching. I could have moved him into position, but I think this will be I think this will be fine. Cologne is being attacked. We'll get in here, Cologne. I don't like that I have to fight in this in the woods. Um well, go take care of him. <laughs> oh, here they come. Uh Dithmar where okay, I really should find Dithmarsh. You're allied with 
Okay, so he's right there, so he shouldn't be coming down for a while. I could go up there and wreck him first, but I would like to stay by my troops. These guys are going to go in through the south. Watch out, don't let... Please don't let the planet get attacked first. Okay, so there's the Martian. Let's go down a speed, just in case I need to bail. Okay, so they're going to take that back. Fantastic. I'm doing all the work here. <laughs> Taking the fort. They're staying pretty close. I have another mission. What is this, Charlemagne's Legacy? No. Trustworthy Allies, okay. And this gives me Diplo reputation for 25 years. Ooh, that'll be really good for this. So Saxony is secure and so is Cologne. The Platinum is really close. Awesome, so I think I'm set to be the next Emperor. Let's see, we have three versus three. So if I get the Platinum, I think I'll get it. Let's improve relations just while we have, we can do all of them. 